Hello. So here I will be showing where to get the Bloodhound step. So the first step is traveling to this place, the third church of Marika, I think, which is in um, the first area. You go to this marker that I marked. There is a teleporter. So you just go straight, hop off the rocks, and the teleporter is right here. You can do this at the beginning of the game, it is totally possible. So we'll get through the loading screen, you want to turn around, miss the boss, and just follow this route that I'm showing here now. I have the video sped up so it doesn't take as much time, I can't stand long tutorials myself. This is as fast as I can speed this up, so we shimmy on down here. You can touch this gray site, I did, but upon touching it, you will have to turn around. So here I show the location, turn back around, come up and to the right. Now right here there is a cliff side that I forgot about the first take. Um, so yeah, don't kill yourself. Now there are poison traps on the ground here. I hit a couple, let's try to miss them. So this boss only comes out at night, so go touch this gray site by the rise, and then you want to turn it to night if you have not yet. So here you see me at the show location again. Here you see me pass time until nightfall, and then night's cavalry will pop up. Now I will be showing you the cheese. You could actually fight this guy if you want, but I'm just cheesing him just to show the easy way of getting it. So you want to aggro the boss. Don't get too far ahead of him, or he will reset. So I kind of, you know, just, just hang out a little bit. So this time it doesn't work. I get too far up, and he reset. He went back to the bridge. So, on the way down I get poisoned. If this happens, just go touch the gray site, and then come back and try it again. Which is what I do here. So I come back, touch this, and then try to do it again. This time I go a little bit slower, I don't get so far ahead of him. Gives him more time to, you know, walk through the traps. So here I halt a little bit, look behind me, make sure he's still coming, I'm like he's not, so I come back down, try to re-aggro him, here he is, move it just a little bit slower, you cannot get very far uh, ahead of him at all. So he reset, so I gotta go back down and do it again, this might take a few tries. Miss the attack. Reaggro. Keep pulling him up. So this time he's actually aggroed to me. He will keep following me up now. So this is what you want. And then you just keep going up. And then out of nowhere. There you go. And that is how you get a Bloodhound step.